Welcome to a new week. Today is day one of five of this new kitchen cabinet transformation I'm doing this week. If you are new to my page, my name is Oseas Zelea. I am a cabinet refinisher. I do projects in five days for the most part. Um, depending on the project, I may, it may take longer, but this week I'm spraying two colors and I will be finishing it in five days. I'm a one man show. I do the entire project by myself and there's a reason why I do it. So follow me, let's go into this project and I will show you what my day one looks like. This is the first time I've seen this project. I sent a quote online and I have not seen the project. I don't know what, I know what the kitchen looks like. Let's see what I'm dealing with. I usually don't get this luxury that I'm able to park my trailer right in the garage. But I'm super happy that uh, I'm not in the freezing cold. To park my trailer in the garage is nice. Um, my 4x6 trailer has got everything I need. I just pack it in when I'm done the last job. Then I just bring it in to the new job site. It works perfectly for me. Again, if you have a trailer, wrap it, put your logo, put your information. I can't tell you enough how many people I've seen. Just take pictures of the trailer, asking the neighbors what's going on um, this week. Of course, it's in the garage, but it's nice. It's good. It's a must when you have a business. Mask. So that's okay for now. Yep. Yeah. Awesome. Again, one of the first things I bring is my zip wall uh, barrier sheets, the reusable barrier sheets, reusable door entry. It's handy, easy carrying to the job. Now that my tools are inside, take a little bite. And just take a look on what I'm dealing with this week. Sharp edges, sharp, sharp edges. All here, I'm gonna be able to round them off, get a nice finish. These doors are dark, so what I'm worried about is the coverage needs to be on point with the primer. That's a good sandwich. This is my day one. was my day one it went absolutely smoothly I love Mondays Mondays are the best days uh, so recap of today everything went well I did most of the prep and uh, I'm just gonna it's what time is it right now it is 1 1 37 p.m. I I will be heading home getting ready take a shower and go out on a date date night today today is a date night with my wife uh, I'm looking forward to it so I'm gonna go try this restaurant uh, on the Quebec side I'll probably share some some views and, uh, got reservations for 6 p.m. today so I got lots of time to go home take a shower relax and uh, today, I boosted an ad right before I got here to work. Right before I got here, I boosted an ad on Facebook. I've gotten, I don't know 
maybe Monday people want to get things going but I got three sorry no two leads from Facebook and I got one lead on a referral it was a text message that he texted me saying I knew this person and they recommended me so she sent me the photos through text so I got two submissions on Facebook and one referral on text so I will respond I don't have much signal in there so I will respond once I get home uh, probably I will grab a coffee and just quickly respond to them just to let them know that I got their their request today's been a great day getting home I need to prepare for tomorrow when I do the sanding on all the cabinet doors I believe there's 34 doors that I'm doing this week two colors and I have here all my surf prep pads. I even got my surf prep rectangular pads, half inch thick, squishy, so I can use it on my Festool sander. Um, I'll grab some so I can prepare myself for a smooth day two. I'm just grabbing myself a tea from Tim Hortons. Start my day two. Not cold today, which is great. Last week it was minus 17, minus 15. Hello? How much? 965. 695. Oh, 69? Oh, perfect. Thank you so much. Great. So. I'm just, I like to start early. I usually start my projects around 7.30 a.m. to 8 a.m. That is the time that I start because one's, one, I beat traffic in the morning and the other is that I just get a head start on the day and uh, my day doesn't drag on to the afternoon because I started late and then just I don't know I feel like I have I can just focus on work for work you got to show up you got to show up like you're showing up to a hockey game or a basketball game you got to show up you got to be prepared mentally uh, that's how serious I take it you got to be prepared every time you go into the home every time you go into the game you have a game plan and you're gonna go execute what you are uh, what you have planned and if you have, if you execute really well, you have a great day. You have a great game, and you have to think yourself as a superstar. You are a superstar. You have to go in thinking you're LeBron James because you need that confidence, uh, and that will portray to the customer. You know, so that's very important. Uh, being a cabinet refinisher, it's not just about doing the job, getting the job, uh, giving the best price. No, it's about you as a person as a your persona when you show up you're you show you're showing up like this guy is an athlete he's a superstar here he is the superstar and he's about to perform and that is how I take it I mean as ridiculous as it sound I mean I have such a, a athletic background uh, playing all playing sports especially basketball and that is the same focus that I bring into my work the same focus and that's why I, I, I thrive and I deliver because I'm focused. I'm focused on what I'm doing and you have to love it. So obviously if you don't love it, you don't have a passion for the job, uh, you, you don't like your craft, you don't want to you know, keep learning your craft, you will not 
um, be, I wouldn't say as successful, but you definitely won't be at your highest potential. Good morning, today is day three. I will be trying something new this week when it comes to protection. I've been eyeing this product for quite some time now and finally came in. I will be doing a review and kind of what my thoughts about this mask is when it comes to protection. So stay tuned for that. Today is all about the primer. I still have a few things I need to do but for the most part, it is, I, don't, I think it was, I have to check the time, but I think I showed up at 7.30, so it's probably around 7.50 right now. So it's like at 7.50 a.m. and I'm about to just get things organized and spray two coats on the doors. Everything is hung, ready to go. I have my GX19 that I will be spraying <clears throat> Once again, Bin Shellac, most reliable primer out there for tan and bleeding coverage, drying time. It's just the fastest, best product for primer. I will be spraying Renner 765 with the 404 hardener, two colors this week. This is the best premium product you can get when it comes to cabinetry coating. It's from Italy. I get it delivered to my home from Toronto with the hardener additive mixed at 5%. That's it, that's my day three. I just finished spraying the two coats on the doors, two coats on the structure, the one as planned. Any hiccups that I had today was the doors that I'm working on this week, they, they are a red dye stain. And when you have a red dye stain and you sand it, there's a lot of bleeding that comes through. So you really have to wait for the first coat of primer to dry really, really well. Give it that 30 to 45 minutes before you spray the second coat because the first coat is going to lock everything in it's going to seal it and then the second coat is going to make it white as it should be welcome back today is day four or five today the focus now that the primer has dried overnight two coats i will be sanding the doors i'm using my surf prep very fine pad with the festool block also, I used to use these crappy, like, you know, just like COVID masks, reusable, very uncomfortable. Even the 3M ones, very uncomfortable to, um, you know, put on, leaves a mark on my face. So I've been eyeing this product. From base camp, reusable filters amazing six layer filter filtration protects you and right away very comfortable very very comfortable it comes with the replacement filters it's got some eapi filter technology so now i'm protected and i can start the sanding We made it, Friday is here. I'm just about to pull up to the client's home and install this kitchen. Two colors.
Saturday morning, 8.30 a.m. Gonna go to open gym with my brother Dennis. I grew up playing basketball most of my life. It's my main sport, love the sport. It's what I did all my life and I continue to do it. So let's go to the gym. little recap of this week was again spring two colors five days say hello to Dennis what's up Dennis? my older brother what's where, up where I learned everything from <laughs> even basketball <laughs> next week is gonna be my third week spring again two colors five days it's not very common I got the cardio and I got the consistency to keep going so let's see how next week goes I also will be dropping another hat I just don't know when, but uh, I'm definitely on it. Great session of basketball. See you guys next week.